coming to 1987. This stadium's undergone many name changes over the years, but whatever they call it, it's always a beautiful location to play a college football game. This coin toss presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Smith O'Donnell has the ball set how he wants it. And we're just about ready to kick this game off, folks. He sends this one deep. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. And he's tackled after positive yardage. That makes it second and six. Brought down at the 43-yard line. Very well-designed play that time to give them a first down. The linemen executed their blocks nicely, and it went for a good game. Great run, and he's brought down in the backfield. The D-line did a good job of nullifying out the blocks up front, and that allowed the linebacker to roam free and make the tackle in the backfield. From their own 38-yard line, second down. And down he goes at the 47. Gain of nine yards. That'll make it third and five. They'll bring him down at the 41-yard line. A good play fake that time. Here, the play action was key. It held the linebackers there by the fake by the running back, and the running back did a very nice job of carrying out his fake. And he hits him hard at the 38-yard line. made the 37 yard line and so it's another third down upcoming here You admire their faith in the running game, but a pass might have been the better way to go. Certainly they don't have the return on here. And it goes out of the end zone for the touchback. Now the offense gets ready to take their first crack at it. So they pick up quite a few yards on that play, Kirk. Well, that was an excellent route, and he did a great job of holding on to the football. They'll go Brown, and he's taken down around the 33-yard line. complete and he's hit right away gets to about the 41 yard line Field. Quick pass. 
He's taken down at about the 41. He is such a reliable target. You throw it anywhere near him, and this guy's going to get his hands on it and make a catch. Gets it out quickly, and he's tackled at the 36. Second and five. Ball on the 36. Second and five. Keeps his eye on it, makes the catch. He makes it to the 18-yard line. Throws a strike over the middle. The five. He makes the PAT. A nine play, 80 yard drive. And they put up seven points. An amazing drive for this offense. Outstanding execution. If you're the defense, you've got to do something to try to change things up to get this quarterback out of sync. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He's to the 20. He gets out to about the 18-yard line. The Hurricanes are right where they want to be early in this football. Well, this is what their coach talked about, getting off to a great start. The defense did their job, and it's nice to see the offense move the ball down the field and also get some points on the board. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. He's got it with room to run, and they make the stop at the 30. They'll spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five-wide outlook. Passes to the left, and it's going the other way. And they'll return this one all the way. I just don't think he saw the defender, and he threw the ball right at him. That's what happens when you focus on one guy. You get tunnel vision. From the 19-yard line, first down. Miami is up a score. He's tackled at the 17-yard line. gets it through the air. Yeah, they've had some success in their short passing game, so they felt confident they could make that play work down inside the 10. And he adds the extra point. So a short three-play, 18-yard drive, and they get it in for seven. The score now, 14-0. O'Donnell gets set to kick this one away. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. Makes it to the 22-yard line. The Hurricanes have found a way to shut this offense down, but hey, it's still early in the football game. Yeah, give them a lot of credit for the way they've played up to this point, but just based on watching these teams and preparing for this game, not be surprised to see this offense eventually find itself and start to execute much better. Gives it to the back. And he carries the ball for a nice game. Tries to get around the corner. Tackle at the 30-yard line. A 
That's a great tackle at the 42. Call it a game. He gets out to about the 45-yard line. That makes it second and six. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. That'll bring it in to the first quarter of action. 14-0, Miami. Back to the action now here in the second quarter. He might have a chance. He makes it to the 48-yard line. That's a game of three on the play. That makes it first and ten. Four down, four down. Check 59. Mike, Mike is free. Easy, easy, easy. One, two. One, two. One, two. And he's level at the 50-yard line. Really good job by the big guys up front to use their size and speed and get the runner in the backfield. Second down at 12. Ball on the 50-yard line. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Fires out to his wideout. And they push him out at the 34-yard line. And a nice pick up there. I'll tell you what, the defense gambled a bit here and came with the blitz, and the quarterback showed tremendous poise by making a good read and delivered a nice ball to the open man. Fires it out. Brought down around the 26-yard line. That's a game of eight on the play. That makes it second and two. Five wide. Makes the grab past the marker. First down. He's under some heat. Quick throw out to the receiver. The five. Touchdown, North Carolina State. Tremendous example of the type of chemistry that these two players enjoy. When a quarterback and a receiver are on the same page, good things tend to happen. And he converts the extra point. North Carolina State, the kick. He just drills this one. He's tackled at the 18. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Miami is up seven. Throws complete, big loss. Five-yard loss on the play. This defense is fast enough that they can create negative yards on completed passes. So the offense might want to consider that next time they try that play. Second and 15. Ball on their own 13. Fires across the middle, and down he goes around the 22-yard line. Pulls it in, first down, and he's knocked out of bounds. Handed off. Gets out to around the 45. Caught out of the open. 
Griffin. He's brought down in the open field. at right side. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. Second down, 10 to go. Ball on the 44-yard line. Johnson gets the call again, and he tackles him hard at the 41. Miami is up by a touchdown. wrapped up for the sack. The smart quarterbacks and offensive linemen have a really unique relationship. A quarterback should take care of his offensive linemen. But after that play and that hit, you really got to be wondering what kind of relationship this quarterback and his offensive linemen have after that. Fourth and long here after the sack. They've got 10 guys up. It looks like they're going to try to block this one. He makes it out to maybe the 23-yard line. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. They'll bring him down at the 28-yard line. That brings him second and five. Caught with room to work. Tackle made at the 44. Good job here by the receiver to look the ball in and ensure he had possession. That's the right way to catch a pass. He's going to go for the home run. Can't connect. They went with the long ball, but he put too much arm into it. It looked like he overestimated the speed of his receiver on that one. From their own 44-yard line. Second down. Halfback's got it on the quick throw. And he is drilled at the 41-yard line. That makes it first and 10. Over the middle to his tailback. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. They lose three yards there. They really just didn't have any room to work on that play. The defense just suffocated him there. Fumble, loose ball. Scoops up the loose ball. Brought down with only one man to beat. So the offense turns over the pigskin. The ball carrier here was just careless in handling the ball. And a great awareness by the defense to jump on. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Miami up seven points. Fires out to his receiver. And he's taken down right around the 34. He ran a good-looking route and picked up positive yardage. That he did, and he made a good catch. That short passing game is where you see all those hours in the summer that you put in pay off. Finds his man. First down. He's taken down around the 20-yard line. First time out of the half here. First down, and they've got their eyes on that goal line. Lost left, met behind the line. Excellent pursuit by the defense. They're getting off their blocks, and that time they tracked him down for a loss. Brought down in the open field. Fires 
quickly, and he's got his receiver for the touchdown. That's TD pass number three. Defense better make some adjustments, and they need to make them now because this passing attack is making a highlight film right now. zone down for a touchback they're ready to begin another drive fires out quickly to the tailback very good tackle in space he ran a good route there and was able to pick up yards underneath the coverage. It's okay to move the ball in small portions because it relaxes the offense and can open things up for the big play. He flings it. And he hits him hard at the 31. That makes it first and ten. He's on the run, and he's tackled at about the 31. Zips it out to his runner, and he's got him again. And they make the stop at about the 21. Can they get it? Caught. Touchdown, NC State. He splits the uprights with the extra point. So we've played two quarters. Miami in front. All right, Reese and David, thanks, guys. Second half action just about ready to start here. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down to the end zone for a touchback. Both teams have really answered the bell here in the third quarter, Kirk. Well, exciting to see what these offenses have been able to do here. Be able to come out and score in your first drive. Tells you a lot about what they did during the half. We're about set to start things up again. Three down, three down. Miami is up a score. Ready. Check, check. He's got it with room to run. He gets hit out of bounds at the 45. Slings it. He's at the 40. He's tackled at the 38 yard line. Good open field tackle. He 
fights forward to about the seven. Call it a gain of two yards. That brings him second and goal. They're at the seven. It's second down. There's a strike complete. Touchdown, Hurricanes! That throw for six gives him four touchdowns. Well, what we have right now is a quarterback who's very comfortable with his offense. He believes in his system, and the coaches and players believe in him. You couldn't ask for a better situation. And he adds the extra point. Sends it sailing downfield. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. Quick throw, incomplete, one of his receiver. From their own 25-yard line, it's second down. Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wideouts. Tackle at about the 39-yard line. That makes it first and ten. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Brought down around the 46-yard line. Gaines with the tackle at the 46-yard line. That'll bring up second and three. Roger. Check 59. Right to the left. Gets it. He's in space. To the 20. The 10. Touchdown, Wolfpack. He's thrown his third touchdown pass of the game. What I'm noticing more and more about this guy is he's very patient with the ball, and it's resulting in some nice scores, just like we've seen today. I'm kind of surprised. These guys are still losing after the type of game that this quarterback's having. And he hits the PAT. A four-play, 75-yard drive. And the result, seven points. Boy, that is scoring in a hurry. This offense is looking more and more explosive. So the score now, 28-21. He really got a hold of that kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Both these defensive coordinators have got to be going crazy right now. We've had four straight possessions in which these offenses have put points on the board. The last time out, they were able to pick up big chunks of yards through the air. You wonder if they'll go back to that same strategy or will they start to lean a little bit more on their ground game. Throws complete. He's got space to work. And he's level at the 29-yard line. That makes it second and six. Miami is up seven. Runs outside for a nice game. That'll bring up third and two. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. Run up the middle. That makes it seven and six. Gets to about the 44 yard line. No That'll make it third and five. Three down, three down. He's at the 40. 
And he holds that one in. And he's tackled right away. From the 40-yard line, it's first down. Tackled back behind the line of scrimmage. Taken back three yards. Really, they just had nowhere to go after the catch. This is the eighth play of this drive. Gets rid of it quickly. And he's knocked down immediately after the catch. Miami is up by a touchdown. He's got all day. And he's hit immediately. Play action. Now he's going to run and watch out. Excellent open field tackle. Looks like someone got a head start on the line. False start. Offense. That penalty will move him back a bit. Yeah, with so many young guys out there, it's bound to happen occasionally. Second and nine coming up here. Ten yards to the end zone. He scrambled. Quarterback's going to run it, and he's got room to work. Dives, and he's down. Morris picks up about seven yards there, scrambling away from the pressure. football right there getting down to the goal line and just punching it in and he converts the extra point so a 12 play 81 yard drive and that's good for a touchdown Fred I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense and it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Well, somewhere Andre Ware is doing a game today, and he'd be smiling if he was doing this one. We've got nothing but offense going on in this football game. They got into the end zone last time. Let's see if they can match that on this possession. So much of the passing game is about the timing between the quarterback and his wide receivers. Right now with this offense, they are in sync, and really the timing and execution is flawless. That makes it first and ten. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. Here they come, and they bring him down for a sack on the play. Man, these guys can be aggressive. When you stand back there and take hits like that, you definitely are going to feel it the next day. Defense looking for another sack in this second down and long situation. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Fires quick out to the receiver and he can't make the grab. So that'll make it fourth down. The offense really had nowhere to go on that one. The play was very well defended, and now the incompletion will force the fourth down in a punt. Foley is back deep to return. Foley takes it at the 21, tackle at the 27. The Hurricanes have shown here in the third quarter they're not content.
content to just sit on that lead they built in the first half. Well, they did a nice job in the first half, but the adjustments that they made at halftime have allowed them to find some matchups to their advantage, and they've taken uh, full advantage of it. That's three down and one to go. Miami's lead is two touchdowns. All right, we're just about set to start action here again in the fourth quarter. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. They'll bring him down at the 37. Quick strike to the receiver. Tackle made at the 45-yard line. effect this could have on him but you can be sure they'll go to him again you know they'd like to do something a little more than they did on their last drive when they had to punt the ball away so the question here is whether or not his knee hit the ground before the ball came out So the booth and the referee agree. The runner's knee was down. That was still a close call, though, Brad. Even though he was down, this guy has to do a better job of holding that football. And he throws it away. From the 39-yard line. Second down. He's going to air it long. Almost picked off. You like a team that's ready to defend the pass. It takes some preparation to get in the way of a pass like that. Passes left, gets it out to the halfback. And he's taken down at the 24-yard line. And for Morris, he continues putting up good numbers, and now that's 300 yards through the air. This young man really works at it, and it's always a boost to see that hard work reflected in the box score. He should be very pleased. And even though they're comfortably in the lead, it doesn't look like they're going to stop passing the ball. Seven-play, 58-yard drive, and they come away with seven points. You, know, you could throw the football as well as these guys can. You don't necessarily always have to have a balanced attack because you're so proficient to throw the ball. Excellent kick. He's to the 20. And he's shoved out of bounds around the 27-yard line. Their last drive broke down, and they punted. What do they have in store this time out? it out to his receiver in a hurry and down he goes at the 46 that's a good looking throw and catch obviously the defense is going to have to give them some room but they're not going to give up the big play he's on the run slides down first down And they make the stop at about the 15-yard line. 
So it's second and ten. Ball on the 15-yard line. Just throws this one away. Inside handoff. And he's tackled after positive yardage. Fourth down, and the offense is still on the field. End zone picked off. And the quarterback just can't believe it. He really wishes he could have that one back. Every quarterback has passes that he wishes he could have back. However, hey, a pick is a pick, and no one is going to care how bad he wants that one back. Just under three to go in regulation. He's out to the 30. And he's tackled at the 41-yard line. Nothing tentative on that run at all. He looked very determined and got the first down. First and 10. Ball on their own 41. It and he stops short of the line of scrimmage. Little handoff. He's tackled at about the 41. Third down now, and they need to get it inside the 49. by the defense to know where the first down was and stop him short of it. That'll bring up fourth and five. Smith back to return it. He makes it out maybe to the 26-yard line. He did a good job there to give his team decent field position. Nothing left here except to see the clock hit zero. A comeback is just not happening. He's taken down around the 49-yard line. And that should do it. Our final tally in this one. Miami, 42. North Carolina State, 21. That brings this broadcast to a close.